Lovely shot down the ground. It was there to hit, yes. Timing pretty good too. We go all the way for four. Four more here. Pulled away powerfully. Managed to put very quickly onto the back foot. Gone. Flash outside off stump. It's not a full length ball. Strauss plays one shot too many there. This is a good wicket. Big wicket has been in form. Nicely played. He's using the pace. Time beautifully, four runs. Driven in rather you know, a bit of stiff footwork, really, from Cook, but he's timed it nicely enough. Runs up the hill. Nicely whipped this time, running down the hill, but sure it'll go all the way. It does. <laughs> That's a much better shot. Beautifully played. Very, very straight bat. Nice timing. Four runs. There you go. Inside edge. Half forward. Little inside edge onto the stumps. As to Cook has gone. So Jaffa. Pitch it up, it'll swing. First ball, Kevin Peterson's gone. It is an absolute perler. Play this if you can. It's also an outstanding catch from Ramdin. Well, Ramdin well, starts to go, doesn't he, down the leg side of it, but that's a fantastic delivery first up. Nicely played. In the gap, up the hill. I think he's got enough of it, that will go all the way. Fine shots, very quickly onto that, nicely positioned for it. Nicely taken, it was low, but it uh, looks to have carried. Devon Smith, the man with those safe hands at second slip. And uh, it's Paul Collingwood who has to go now, and this has been a very, very good spell from Fidel Edwards. Rare poor delivery in this spell from uh, Fidel Edwards. It's a little bit of a gift, um, one that is greatly received. It's four runs, and it takes Ravi Bapara in his first outing at number three for England to a well-made 50. That's runs. Good shot. Three boundaries in the over for Matt Pryor. Driven firmly. And beats the man at deep cover. Four more to Bapara. That's where Matt Pryor is good through the offside. He's very free-flowing through there. Language swing of the blade, 156 for four. Very fine. And four. Good shot. No point chasing those. Well timed. Dropped. Could have been another wicket. Could have been the big one that the West Indies were hoping for. That's four runs. Very fine, but wicket keeper had no chance of getting to that. Then the Simmons, the man in the extra cover region. A gift, gift of a dismissal to the West Indies from Matt Pryor. And Paul doing the chasing, it's all downhill. That's a good shot. That's why you can write this man off. Don't think that when he gets to the crease, the batting is over. Oh, another one goes down. Fidel Edwards, what has he got to do? It's 
going to go fine. He'll go all the way. Full toss. That'll be four runs. Short board. Left off early, but makes no mistake with this one. That will do nicely. Crowd responds, his teammates respond. England have been looking for a number three, they've just found one. Oh, he wants his name on the board. He's a confident young man. The par 100, 207 deliveries, 12 fours. Shot, it? It's a little bit uppish for a while. Well, that's a good shot, Stuart Broad. It's beaten the man at backward point and will run away. It's beautifully timed by Bapara. Gone, finally, Broad offers a chance, and this time it's accepted gratefully by Jerome Taylor at backward point. Appeal and gone. Seventh wicket down. Little slider from Suleiman Ben. Smack down the ground. Fast ball, a new ball. England 300 on the board, 302 for seven. Another super shot from Swan. Into the front foot and through extra cover. Successive boundary fours. He's on the drive again. Graham Swan, number nine batsman. That's three drives against the new ball. Driven again. There's four more. It's a driving range. 50 partnership, 325 for seven. Too wide. And whacked for four. It's on the up, hit over Gully. And hit away for four. Full delivery, Bopara likes it there. Very strong down the ground yesterday. Superb through mid on. Clipped away, that'll be four. Graham Swan, well, it's a magnificent half century. Delighted, and why not? The momentum was, I suppose, with England first thing this morning, and it's now certainly with England. Out he goes. Driving on the up. Nash has taken the catch. And uh, Ravi Bakara's face tells a bit of a story there. He was keen to carry on. He looked good all morning. That little drive on the up wasn't quite timed, and West Indies have their breakthrough. That's a good shot. Another boundary. That will do. That's his five foot. Anderson with a flash. Outside off stump. That's done for him. England are nine down, but Fidel Edwards has deserved that. He's got five foot. Oh, that'll do nicely. Well, he has got six for fast, full, straight. Don't bother with the pitch. England's innings is finished. Swan finishes on 63, not out. Team total 377, all out. One delivery for Graham Onions. Everybody will want to see him bowl. Deserved six wickets. Fidel Edwards, six for 92, 26.3 overs. He's on the board. Languid for Chris Gale, back with a point. The ball has been caressed wonderfully down the ground. It's a full ball, yeah, it needs to be hit. But it's great control from Chris Gale. Oh. Well, that's four. Runs again for Chris Gale. Don't think it was that well timed, but he's a strong man. It will go all the way. Here's another chase. Now he had to dive this time and another boundary. 
That's gone for four. Just a fraction too short from Jimmy Anderson. The movement is there. That's four. You don't mind that as a bowler, though, because he's actually given that a chance. He's actually trying to swing this one into Chris Gale. Bowled him. Came back in quite sharply. Always a chance. Chris Gale doesn't want to move his feet. Immediately off the mark. Scores most of his runs through the offside, but still pretty good through the onside. Got in this time, that's good bowling. Stuart Broad picks up his second wicket of the innings in reasonably quick succession. And two good names are in his bag. That's a very nice little shot. Firm push, now he's relying on the slope and his timing to take that the boundary and his trust is absolutely right. Good shot. A little bit short, it's pulled away and pulled away very well. Another good, firm, solid push from Devon Smith. Just look how well he's timed it. He's back into the attack now, Graham Swan. Had a great winter. Yeah! And gets a wicket straight away. Yet again, Devon Smith is undone by Graham Swan. Through the gate. Third wicket down. He struggles against him, doesn't he? Got the wood on him. Around the wicket, non-spinner. Got it! Yeah! He's gone, first ball. Graham Swan picks up two and two. Shivaran Chandrapal caught at slip. Big, big wicket. He just said this is a big, big wicket. Swan is obliged. It's a perfect off-spinner. That's his shot. Starts with a boundary after T. As he likes to use his feet, he likes to hit straight, and he likes to hit it for six. Edged and brilliantly caught by Paul Collingwood. Superb from him. Swan all over the West Indies. Edged and gone. Gone, gone, gone. England holding their catches. First test wicket for Graham Onions. Well taken as well. He's bowled well in that previous over. This one, Simmons can do nothing with. Bowled off the glove. Was it off the glove? Yes, off the glove. Gone. One for Onion, two for Onions. And West Indies in all sorts of trouble. 117 for seven. Edged and gone as well. You can't keep Swan out the game. Brilliant catch, brilliant England. Terrific stuff. Three wickets in the over for Graham Onions. He started the over with no wickets to his test career now. He's got three. Did that carry... Great effort in the gully. Driven before. Take that. Oh, huge appeal. And yes, Soccer de Silva. Williams and Gravy. Four for, four for 24 into his seventh over. Oh, whipped away, thrashed away mid wicket. Should be four. Through mid wicket, fast outfield, down the hill. It's a good shot, real good shot. Nobody's fetching that back. That's 150 on the board for the West Indies. That's close. Where did it pitch? As according to Mr. Ashoka de Silva, it has pitched in line and five for Onions. What a scene for Graham Onions. Not an easy start for him, but what a comeback. He says a lot about his temperament, his ability to fight back. Really, really impressive stuff from a young man. Yeah, delight on everyone's face. There's the coach. They've got it right, England. They had a poor start.
Maybe reassess the Graham Swan option with the new ball. But apart from that, all the bowlers, the fielders, the catching has been outstanding. Yep, delight for that young man. Well, he's dispatched that quite comfortably. Oh, and gone. Swan with good hands. Identify the danger. It's the captain, one of the best players. Quiet game for Chris Gale. Gone again. Oh, he bowled him. Inside edge, in Ducker. Ball for and got. It's a good shot. Beautiful shot. Pulled away in the gap. Goes for four. That'll be four. Nice start. Plays that well. Just have enough on it to reach the boundary. Good shot. On the bottom hand in that. Whipped away, has it carried? Yes, it has. Another fine catch from England. It's Onions again. Alistair Cook takes the catch. It's a good catch. He wasn't sure if he was going to carry it first, but uh, he got the dive in. And it pulls off the mark. He's off a pair. Down the hill, away for four. Inside edge there, was there? Yes, Swan's done it again. Chandler Paul twice in the match. Good catch this as well. Said I felt these men might come into play because very difficult when the odd ball turns and turns quite a bit. It's hard hit in the gap, hit for four. Bold him! What a beauty, middle stump's gone. Terrific stuff. Middle stump out the ground. There's no better sight. Pulled away. Got to go all the way for four. So he's delivered at the end of the over. And we went for that York of a full length ball. I don't mind that. So occasionally I don't quite get it right and you get tripped away, but. I like the idea in the attempt. Takes that short ball on and finds the boundary. It's a good start for any batsman. Nash cracks the ball away back with a point. Four more. Beamed away through extra cover, a ball of very full length. Oh, terrific shot. Stand and deliver shot through wide mid off. That's nicely timed and it's just snuck past Gully. That's a before. Very nice little shot, very deft. In the aid of uh, timing at a slope, that's uh, reached the boundary rather easily. Beautifully struck. Made it look very, very easy there. Good length, but a good shot, driven down the ground. Chase for Stuart Broad. Look at this quick outfield. He's not getting there. Four more, it's short, it's four, 100 partnership. Back and before. Ball goes away down the hill, just about creeps to the boundary. 50 for Ramden. Nobody moves. 
back. Somebody in the crowd might just throw that back. 50 for Nash. Oh, that'll be four more. He stands and admires the shot, Dinesh Ramdin, as he moves on to 55. Again, through that offside. He does love it square on the offside. Save your legs, Ravi Bopar, at four. Square again on the offside. Four again. That's not a great delivery from Broad. Back up, no third man. Intentional shot. Four more. Bowled him! Through the defences, the ball is drifting in. Broad gets the breakthrough. Full of length. Again, the ball comes back down the slope. Driven firmly down the ground. Stuart Broad not impressed. He drills it on the offside, down the ground, beautifully played. Very close with the curve, yes! It was too full to sweep and it curved and was going to go down on a round middle stump, I fancy. Yeah! Bowled in beautifully bowled by Swan. Flatter, quicker, and going on with the arm and far too good for Suleiman Ben. Come! Really good bouncer, nipping back at Fidel Edwards. And all he could do was fend it off in the air, straight to Tim Bresnan in the gully. West Indies nine down. It's in the air. How well has he hit it? He's taken. He thought that might, might, might come into play. And it's a good catch in the end. And Nash's resistance comes to an end. Stuart Broad deserves that wicket. He's got well in this spell. Now that left England 32 runs needed for victory in the sunshine at Lords. It was the captain, Andrew Strauss, who finished things off in very nice style. And the celebrations on the balcony began. So a very, very good result for the New England team.